In the future computer systems, they will be intelligent and they will be empathic. They will be capable of understanding the user and the context. My name is Pablo Cesar. I work here at CWI and I lead the group uh, Distributed and Interactive Systems. The goal of this group is to look at fundamental problems that are associated with how people work with each other through technology. I think the interesting thing about this group is that it's a nice combination of experimental research, but always at the background looking for fundamental models of how people interact and really look at how that interaction can be modeled and what we can learn from it. The group uses uh, realistic uh, testing grounds in order to validate our research. That's because we think that results in the lab, they are completely different from results in the world or in reality. In particular, we are looking into smart cities and creative industries. We have projects in various different areas with various different companies. One example of such collaborations is by Bore. With him, what we are studying is smart textiles. It's really about the textiles and how they can help understanding your context, your needs, and how that in turn can help you uh, creating better experiences. I'm Bora, Bora Akkersdijk, and I run uh, the studio called By Bora. It's a textile innovation studio. Well, we are looking on textiles on and around the body that can help you with the well-being. So now textiles mostly it's for protection and what we're doing now is adding functionality in the shape of sensor technology that can also communicate them. It's sometimes hard to grasp but it's an extension also of your mobile telephone and the mobile telephone everybody understands. They can gather data that helps to understand the context, the user and actually that data can be used in order to improve the experience of that user using services. A critical part of science is to do good science that you also demonstrate has value in the world. And this group is exceptional at that. And they've done it by having partners in the real world like the BBC and by Bore. They build full stack prototypes to make things that people actually use. I think that in the, in the coming several years we will achieve what we are set up to do. We have the, the, the right contacts and the right partnerships in order to look at the problems from a different perspective and in order to leave a, a real legacy for, for the future to come.